Um, really, I don't know, and she doesn't know how we're gonna say about the Brahmapuri. So, it is a reflection of what happened in Sahajaga for the last 50 years. What you're seeing, Auntie Kensler next to me, joined Sahajaga in 1975. So we are talking five years after the Sahajaga was opened. The techniques which Ramataji used by then and where we are today, 50 years later, and the way we spread Sajoga and where we spread Shrimataji's love throughout the world. Everywhere, every person had their realization, whatever methods or wherever they were at the time, it had it, they had their role. And all with that role, here we are today in the world as a one. You come here as we are one group. There are a lot of other groups as well. But in the end, we are all flowers of one garland and we offer that to Shamataji. So here we are. We will try to, Auntie Kensila will try to tell a few stories from 1975 onwards till today, how the Brahmapuri came up to this stage. And I will be translating them in English as much as I could. And I will also share some of my stories as well along the line. So my background, I'm, my mom is her younger sister. So she's my aunt and aunt is always the favorite one. So she, her husband, Mr. Kensley, was the first one in our family, came in Sahajaga, uh, 1975 in Rahuri. So I will get her to tell that story in Marathi first, and then I will translate that in English. Uh, is my pronunciation okay for all of you? Am I going too fast or slow? No? Okay, he just told me off. He told me, hold the mic a little bit more closer. <laughs> That's all right, good. Okay, so this is Auntie Kenzelek. So I'll get her to tell the story in Marathi, the beginning part, how the Sajagawa came in our family first. Um, Ani Tula Pahila experience of Sakari Sangota Tisto Jay Shimataji Tar Survatila Kenze Savana Sozo Mirala The Agriculture University Rahuri with Depit Made Professor Hote Ani Sagay Professor Mandari Dhan Kareche आणि मग मी तेव्हा शिवाची भक्ती करायचे म्हणजे लहानपणापासून मी शिवाची भक्ती करायचे माझ्या शेजारी एक ब्राह्मणांचं कुटुंब होतं तर ते म्हणे की 1 लाख फुलं मोगऱ्याची शिवजीना वाहायची मग मी ते मोजून द्यायचे रोज ते टोपलीवर फुलं आणायचे रोज मी मोजायचे आणि पुन्हा काही दिवसांनी त्या म्हटलं की ओम नमः शिवाय असं लिहून कुठेतरी त्यांना द्यायचं होतं मग मी सगळ्या वह्याच्या वह्या भरून द्यायचे मग असं वाटलं ना की सगळ्या सोपा देव महादेव मग शाळेत जाता येता आपलं ओम नम शिवाय पण मंदिरात जाऊन मागायचं मला पास कर पुन्हा काही वर्षानं मग मला चांगला नवरा मिळू दे मग काही वर्षानं मला मुलगा होऊ दे म्हणजे देवाकडं जाऊन सारखं काहीतरी मागायचं मागायचं पण भक्ती सच्ची होती त्यामुळं मला जे मी काय म्हणेन ते मला मिळत होतं I did say we were going to talk from 1975, but she had uh, started a little bit more before that. So we are talking 1940, yeah, 1940. So when she was a kid, uh, there's a place called Koina from here. Her dad used to work, and I started telling that story yesterday, but I didn't get much chance to go into it. 
But last, last year, I took three sisters, she and her two sister, younger sister, to their childhood place where they were. And what I was trying to do was trying to find out their childhood memory, what have they done, how bhakti, the dedication part of the Maharashtrian culture was ingrained within their heart and how that actually helped them in the future to get their realization. It was very nice to watch these three sisters walk through this jungle, bush, and they, after like 45 minutes walk, they discover the Shiva temple where they used to go as a childhood. And that was the Shiva temple. Someone told them when they were ch children that offer flower every Monday there, Shiva will help you. And Shiva resides in our heart. And bhakti, that's how Indian kids get told the spirituality, how to use the bhakti to achieve the goddess or get our realization as well. So as a childhood, that was getting inbuilt within them, nurtured within them, and then they started asking divine, can we please have a nice family? Can we please have a nice kids? Can we please have a realization? And when she grew up and she was married in 1975, she had her realization, the first moment when she mouthed so she, she's gonna start telling you more about that from now on. She matins a program at Rahurichak Krushi with Depita, Adoturum Mate. And he some poor no Adoturum Pul Berleloth. And he can they say when he malabichalaki, to me an arca, Mulamje, Mamchitina, Maza Prasad, a sham char mulamchi, chutti, Thermatahoe and Arki, my hencharu, Madame Gerotu, the tencha table were Kodote. There Motam Radevichalaki, Papa Mikodu Guka. तर हे म्हटले घे की आणि मग शिवाताजी प्रोग्राम साठी आल्या आणि शिवाताजी तारात होत्या तर माझं आत्मा एवढा उत्साह मिळून आला की मी सगळ्यांना पास करून शिवातेंचं दर्शन घेतलं मग ते आत्म्याला परमात्म्याची ओळख पटली आणि मग माझ्या लक्षात आलं की अजून प्रोग्राम व्हायचा आहे शिवाताजी प्रोग्राम लाल्या मग मी माझ्या जागेवर जाऊन बसले आणि मग शिवाताजींचं लेक्चर सुरू झालं तर तिथं ब्लॅकबोर्ड होता पण खडून होता मशी माता जी म्हटली आहो इथे खडू नाहीये मग आमच्या मुलांना लिहून दिला मग त्यालाही आनंद की आपण काहीतरी केलो आणि सुरुवातीला शी माता जी स्वतः सगळे चक्र कुंडलिनी वगैरे फळ्यावर काढून दाखवायच्या सो इन 1975 हर हस्बंड लेट श्री शंकर राव केंजले ही वाज अ प्रोफेसर इन एग्रीकल्चर युनिव्हर्सिटी इन राहुरी एग्री राहुरी कृषी विद्यापीठ in 1975, Shimataji came there for her first uh, public program in that uh, university. And her husband asked, uh, Uncle Kinsley asked her if uh, you and kids wants to come and attend this program. So four kids, so late Chandrasekhar Kinsley, Dr. Heyman Kinsley, Dr. Sujatha and myself, we got dragged along with everyone and we went for the program. That was the first program. Um, when we went to the program, that was the first time Auntie saw Shimataji in presence walking into the auditorium and she knew it the moment she saw it, she knew it, that's it. That's her guru. And it was a moment, um, also her young, late Chandrasekhar Kenzile, he was the oldest one in our family at the time. And back then, Shumataji used to do the programs, um, public programs, and draw uh, chakra drawings and subtle system on a blackboards. And when Shumataji wanted to draw that for the newcomers, there weren't any white chalks or china graphs were left on the board to be driven, to be drawn on the boards. So her son, Luckily had one and he ended up offering and he was very pleased that he actually could help something in that moment. So the stories you hear from Auntie Kensley, I personally feel like um, they're more lean towards the 
bhakti, bhakti aspect. And if you listen to the talk from Shimataji in 1984 or 1985, Pandurpur Shivaratri Puja, it has, Shimataji had mentioned there, there is one, there are three channels we have, left, right, and central channel. But there's one channel which starts from our heart and goes to Sasana. Now that channel has absolute depth of bhakti that starts in our heart, that love, the compassion. When that is attached, our kundalini actually shoots much faster, much better. And that is cause God, divine is always, always seeking for love. Devan is only asking from us is love, nothing else. And bhakti is the mode of achieving that love factor in our meditation. So I mean, all other chakras, all other kundalinis below the muladhara and everything, yes, they are there. Because the love is there, it, that acknowledgement of goddess, of shimataji, and that disciple was very quicker very quicker and that was the time I'm talking 1975 so every decade we change we progress Shumataji's style of spreading love giving realization the master realization changed more and more yeah so program आणि शिवमाताजींच्या प्रोग्राम झाल्यानंतर सगळ्यांनी दर्शन घेतलं मग मी पण घेतलं मग माझे दोन हात त्याच्या शिवमातांचे चरण आणि माझं डोकं शिवमातांच्या चरणावरती तर खूप वेळ शिवमातांनी चरण उचलले नाहीत माझ्या हातातून काहीतरी काढून घेतात असं मला वाटलं आणि मग विचारलं की काय शिवाची भक्ती केली तर हो म्हटलं शिवमाते मी शिवाची भक्ती तर शिवमाताजी म्हटल्या ठीक आहे म्हणे पण कुठलाही मंत्र घेताना गुरुनी सांगायला पाहिजे गुरुनी तो मंत्र दिला की मग गुरु ते सगळं त्या शिष्याचं वाहतात आणि मग काही त्रास होत नाही जर तुम्ही अशीच भक्ती केली तर तुमच्या हार्टवर वगैरे प्रेशर येईल त्याला सद्गुरूच पाहिजे आणि शिवमाताजी मला इतक्या आवडल्या होत्या की मी त्या क्षणापासून सहयोग करायला लागले आणि मग सांगू नको Okay, so that was the moment um, Auntie, Auntie Kenzile went and bowed down to Shimataji. And then in the older days, the way Shimataji used to spend time with every disciple, every newcomers was, um, it's what we do nowadays is our namaskar. We put our, ha we put our hand on the ground and bow down, touch our forehead. It was the same technique but what it was is you put your hand on the ground. Shimataji used to lift the feet up like that. Then our hand used to go underneath. Shimataji will press, put her feet on it, press it down, and our forehead used to go on top of her feet. And that's how Shimataji used to clear. That's how the realization used to be given at the time. And that is what we do. When, when we do Namaskar to Shumataji, the idea behind it is we bow down, we take her feet on top of our hands, in our palm, and we rest our forehead on top of her feet. That's what we should be feeling it when we bow down to Shumataji, to feel that love and get it clean. So when she did that, Shumataji actually kept her feet on her hand for a longer time, and Shumata said, ah, oh, so you've been worshiping Shiva. And she said, yes, Shumata I, I guess. And she said, that is very nice. It's good for bhakti, but for bhakti, it can be lost if it hasn't been guided by a guru. It has to be a proper mantra, which has to be given by a guru. And here we are, our Guru Shimataji, she has given us the root, the channel, the knowledge. We have a bhakti. All she asking from us is a bhakti. Rest, 
She has all the control. She has all the power. And that was the moment Auntie Kensler got her realization and she knew it. That's it. She found what she was looking for. शिव माताजी मला एवढ्या आवडल्या होत्या की मी आमची मुलं लहान होती ती मुलं शाळेत गेली की मग दोन वेळा आंघोळ करायचं दोन वेळा ध्यान करायचं सारखं म्हणजे एक छंदच लागलं की आपलं ध्यानच करायचं आणि सहा महिन्यानं शिव माताजी आल्या तेव्हा मला असं वाटलं की आता शिव माताजी आपल्याबद्दल काय म्हणत आहेत तर जेव्हा मी शिव माताच्या समोर आले म्हणजे येत होते तर सगळ्यांना शिव माताजी म्हटल्या बघा ह्यांची कुंदळणी कुठं आकाशात चालली आणि म्हणजे So after that moment, uh, she was, she knew that's what Shri Mataji is, that's what she's been looking for, waiting for all this time. And she really got into it. She started practicing meditation every day. And ch while children are in the school, she will do twice meditation. But she was really surrendered. She was doing more and more meditation. So six months after when Shri Mataji arrived, Um, Auntie Kenzele was walking through the crowd coming to a Shumataji and Shumataji pointed out to everyone, ah, here she is, look at her Kundalini. It's up there, it's up there. That's what I said. I said, 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 आणि शिव माताजीने शिकवलं मग शिव मातांच्या बरोबर आम्ही औरंगाबाद पैठण श्रीरामपूर अहमदनगर प्रत्येक ठिकाणी आम्ही प्रचार प्रसार आणि पूजेसाठी शिव मातांच्यावर जात होतो आमची चार लहान मुलं होती माझी बहीण माझे मेहुणे आणि आम्ही दोघं असं चार मुलं आणि दोन स्कूटरवर आम्ही संपूर्ण शिव मातांच्यावर फिरत होतो So after that, 1976, we had the first puja in uh, Rahuri. And uh, as I mentioned before, that in last 50 years, we all, have a, we all had our role, the way we came in Sahajaga. At the time, Shumataji actually took Mrs. Kinsley and guided her how to worship her, how to decorate her, how to do pujas. And then later on, Mrs. Kinsley accompanied Shumataji around Maharashtra, different pujas, assisting Shumataji and whatever Shumataji was asking, how to be decorated, what protocols are there. So that's what we were doing and back then, That's where my childhood memory starts, is my dad had an um, Italian scooter called Vespa back then in 1976. And I used to stand in the front, mom in the back, dad in, and another cousin in the back, same auntie, husband has another scooter. And we used to travel hundreds of kilometers with Shumataji in a car, ambassador car, Indian brand. And we've been a lot of pujas like that and auntie Kenzele assisted many of them so to shi matanchi car phule hoti ani ami magavto to shi matajincha car cha pathi magun kachetun prakash evda prakasha cha jyot hota ki to sarkha akasha jat hota sampurna pravasat ami te anubhavlo on on one of this occasion when we were driving behind shimata ji's car She noticed there was a lot of light, a strong light. The vibrations were emitting from the rear window of the car. And it was the moment you could see that divinity is what Shumataji is. That's where always the vibrations are. There are a lot of things that I have to say. आणि श्री मातांच्या सेवेत मी असायचे तर श्री माताजी एकदा एक रूममध्ये झोपल्या होत्या आणि मला म्हटलं की आमचा गुडघा दाबून धरा 
तर मला शिव मातांचा गुडघा सापडेना मग म्हटलं आता काय करायचं मग कुठंतरी दाबून धरलं आता काय करणार ना तर मग हसल्या म्हटलं काय झालं गुडघा सापडत नाही म्हटलं हो शिव आताजी मग म्हटल्या अहो आम्ही मानवाचा देह घेतला आहे पण आमचं शरीर मानवाचं नाही आहे आमचं शरीर देवीचं आहे आमचं संपूर्ण शरीर चैतन्ययुक्त आहे आमचा गुडघासुद्धा मऊ हत्तीच्या पिलाच्या डोक्यासारखा आहे On one of the occasion in um, Rahuri, Auntie uh, Shumataji was resting in a guest house and um, Auntie was assisting Shumataji in the bedroom and Shumataji asked her to uh, give a little bit massage on her foot. So while Auntie was doing it, she realized she can't look at Shumataji's knee. So she just put her hand and just grabbed some part of her Shumataji's foot. And Shumataji laughed and she said, oh, so you can't find my knees? And she said, yes, Shumataji, I can't. And she said, that's because I'm Adi Shakti, I'm a goddess. Even though I'm in human form, I'm still a goddess. And her knees, she said, my knees appears like a head of small elephant. And this is, this is, This is really interesting, that Shumataji, she appeared in front of us in human form and it was different, it was very different. Um, I'll come, I'll take this forward to 2000, uh, 2003, no, 2002. This was in Mumbai. I, I personally was uh, Shumataji's chef. So at one occasion in uh, Mumbai, Kalpana Didi's house, one of the Avra reader expressed his desire that he wanted to see Shumataji's aura. So she, when we asked Shumataji, this, this gentleman wants to see your aura, what do you think? And Shumataji said, yeah, yeah, bring him, ask him to come tomorrow. So he came in the morning after the breakfast and um, Yeah, Shumataji had a quick chat and she said, what do you want? And he said, I just want to, I'm doing some study, I want to see your aura, Shumataji. And she said, okay. So he asked me if he can hold a white, bla- white bed sheet behind Shumataji and he can see the, he can check the aura. I said, yeah, no problem. So me and another person hold the white bed sheet, uh, curtain behind Shumataji. He, he sat in front of Shumataji, did all his calculation, drawing, whatever. And then um, Shumataji had her eyes closed all that time. And um, once he's done, Shumataji said, okay, so what, what do you think? And he just gave some um, different colors and things, because he was looking from the mental side. He was looking from the brain, what colors he's seeing. And then Shumataji said to him, all right, I did what you asked me to do, now I want you to close your eyes, put your hand towards me, and don't think anything. As soon as he did that, Shumataji pointed me, go and raise his kundalini, so I just did behind him. Shumataji was watching him. Once he's done, there was a breeze on top of his head. Shumataji said, okay, hold the curtain again. So me and the person went, hold the curtain back, and um, Shumataji said, now gently open your eyes and look at me. So the gentleman opened his eyes and it was the moment his aura changed. His color, he went absolutely pale. He was sweating and he just like, eyes wide open, jaw dropped, looking at Shumataji and he was surprised, mesmerized completely. And Shumataji said, no, what can you see? <laughs> and he, He just couldn't speak. He just lost his word and he said, oh, you are different. I have never seen anything like this in my entire life. You are just, the way I will put today is you are a reflection. You are just pretending sitting here, but you are somewhere on the other planet. You're not here. You, you are totally different. And Shumati said, that's because I created this universe. I can be anywhere.
Sorry, I, I dragged that somewhere else. Let's go back to, <laughs> to Kenzile. <laughs> तर शिवमातांच्या बरोबर आम्ही सारखा असायचो तर एकदा काय झालं की एक ऑस्ट्रेलियन डॉक्टर ते ते हाडाचे डॉक्टर काय म्हणत ते डॉक्टर तर ते ना त्यांचं मोठं हॉस्पिटल ऑस्ट्रेलियात होतं आणि त्यांना खूप ट्रेस होता तर त्यांना कुणीतरी सांगितलं की तुम्ही हिमालयात जावा म्हणजे भारतात जा मग हिमालयात जा नाहीतर आणि कुठं जा ते ही इथली भूमी छान आहे तुम्हाला इथं चैतन्य मिळेल तर मग ते आणि कुणीतरी सांगितलं की श्री माताजी निर्मला देवी पण आहेत तर तुम्ही त्यांनाही भेटा तर मग ते मुंबईच्या एअरपोर्टवर आल्यावर त्यांनी फोन केला आता त्यांच्याकडे तो नंबर होता श्री माताजींचा मग श्री माताजीच म्हटल्या हां या डॉक्टर वॉरन तुमची वाट बघतोय आम्ही ते एकदम आश्चर्यचकित झाले की माझं नाव ह्यांना कसं समजलं मग ते गेले मग श्री माताजी त्यांच्याशी बोलल्या आणि मग म्हटल्या की आमचा आता महाराष्ट्र दौरा आहे आणि आम्ही आता जाणार आहोत आणि तुम्हाला जायचं हिमालयात शांती वगैरे मिळवायची असेल तर तुम्ही जाऊ शकता तर ते म्हटले नाही म्हणे श्री माताजी आपल्या इथंच आम्हाला छान वाटतं आहे आणि आम्ही आपल्याबरोबरच येणार म्हणून मग ते त्यांची टूर पुण्याहून अहमदनगरला आली पण आम्ही फक्त श्री माताजींचं बघत होतो श्री माताजींच्यावर कोण आहे त्यांच्याकडे विशेष लक्ष दिलं जात नव्हतं मग त्यांनी दोन फोमच्या गाद्या दोघंजण होते त्यांनी फोमच्या गाद्या घेतल्या आणि आपलं आपलं सामान घेऊन ते श्री मातांच्या बरोबर प्रत्येक ठिकाणी फिरत होते सो दिस इज अ स्टोरी अबाउट लेट डॉक्टर वॉरन ऑस्ट्रेलियन सहजोगे ही वॉज अ सिखर अँड ही केम टू ही वॉज इन द सर्च ऑफ रिअलायझेशन So someone told him to go to India and see Shamataji and um she's a guru she will give you a realization so um, he arrived in Mumbai he didn't have much contact details or anything but um he managed to get in touch and when he arrived in Rahuri Shamataji before he could come and introduce himself Shamataji addressed him ah Dr Warren come welcome i've been waiting for you and then he had his realization he had his moment and after that shumati said now if you want you can go to himalayas to do more meditation and your search continue your search and he said no i found what i wanted shumati ji and he continued traveling with shumati ji with a mattress what you're sitting on right now like that the rahuri ji <laughs> rahuritle khup anubhav ahet पण मी आता थोडं ब्रह्मपुरीबद्दल सांगते जस्ट रिमांडेड मी डॉक्टर वॉरन्स एक्सपिरियन्स टू समथिंग एल्स हॅपन टू थाउजंड थ्री आय डीड मेन्शन टुडे टू सम योगीज टू थाउजंड थ्री वी वर ट्रॅव्हलिंग फ्रॉम पुना टू मुंबई अँड शमाथजी जस्ट ॲज वी वर गेटिंग इन अ कार शमाथी सेट प्रसाद I want to go to a place called Lonavla which is halfway between Mumbai and Pune and it is very famous for uh, potato chips and uh, sweet uh, called chikki shengdani chikki it's very famous uh, so if you ever go past please go visit and eat those things so um, as we were living pratishtha shumati asked so i said okay no worries so um, as the car pulled into we took a diversion came into lonavla city and as a human being i was looking at the shop which is posh clean hygienic presentable you know expensive because we were going to buy something for shamathji that was my brain was telling me that's how it should be so on this particular street when you're going there there is at least 200 shops sells the similar item it's it's famous place for that so car was driving and i'm looking at the shops and i can't see any good shop where i can buy things for shamata ji and all of a sudden shamata said stop so we pulled it i looked around and absolutely run down places no clean dusty everything 
And she said, she just pointed one of the shop to me across the road and she said, go in that shop and get this one. I said, okay. And she gave me the cash. There's no way we could argue there. I said, okay, if you want. I took a cash, walked across the road, went in the shop, ordered a few items. And as things were getting packed, um, the shopkeeper said to me, but yeah, who's in the car? And I said, oh, it's uh, Shrimata Janil Maladevi in the car. And this gentleman just started, tears started pouring through his eyes. He was absolutely shaken, surprised. And he said, Jai Shrimata Ji. And it, it completely blew me, like, oh wow. Out of 200 shop, we stopped, Shrimata Ji asked me to stop one shop. Absolutely run down. And there was a surge again. So he wasn't taking any money because it was for Shamataji. So he said, oh, I can't take it. And I thought, uh oh, I'm, I'm going to be in trouble if I don't pay for this. Um, I said, OK, you come with me. So I took him to the car. And as we crossed the road, Shamataji opened the window. I straight looked at him before we could introduce. He said, and how are you? How are you going? How is business going? And he was, he was like, please, that Shamataji was talking to him, he addressed, answered the question. And then I jumped in the conversation. I said, Shumataji, he's not taking the money for all this product. And she said, no, 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 you can't do that. And she took the cash from me, hold it in front of me, and she said, this is not from me. This is from Goddess Lakshmi for you. <laughs> and at the and that moment, I took everything, came in the car, but I was completely blown away. How? How did Shrimataji know? Out of 200 shop, out of 300 kilometers journey, she knew where to stop. And that's where Shrimataji said to me, Prasad, I knew because of his Kundalini. And here we are. Doesn't matter which world, which planet we are, we, not planet, which part of world we're coming from. It's our Kundalini. It's our connection. It's our Bhakti. It's connected with Shrimataji. So our individual connection. We are all flowers. And the uniqueness of all of us is that we can bond together with our love and then connect to Shrimataji in the same way. No matter where we come from, where we reach, poor, whatever we are, but this is where it is. So Dr. Warren's experience just reminded me that mother always knows us, no matter where we are. आता मी थोडं ब्रह्मपुरीबद्दल सांगते तर राहुरीत आमचे खूप प्रोग्राम व्हायचे अशी मातांच्याबरोबर आम्ही खूप फिरायचो मग काही वर्षानं असं वाटायला लागलं ना की आपलं गाव सातारा मग शिव माताजी सातारला आल्या तर मग ए टू टूला शिव माताजीना विचारलं की शिव माताजी आपण सातारला याल का तेव्हा शिव माताजी म्हटलं हो आम्ही जरूर येऊ आम्ही लहान होतो तेव्हा कबड्डीची टीम घेऊन शिव माताजी आल्या त्या शाळेत असताना आणि त्या कबड्डीच्या टीमचं कॅप्टन शिव माताजी होत्या आणि तेव्हा शिव माताजी सज्जनगड अजिंक्य तारा हे सगळं पाहिलेलं आहे असं सांगितलं सो नाव इट्स टर्निंग इन टू ब्रह्मपुरी अँड अ हिस्ट्री ऑफ ब्रह्मपुरी सो आफ्टर नाईन्टी सेवंटी फाय टू एटीज स्पेंडिंग टाम इन रावरी डिझायर दॅट अवर फॅमिली कम्स फ्रॉम दिस एरिया and it will be nice if we can get Shri Mataji coming and visit this place and bring India tour as well. And it was, the desire was exp expressed and it was straight away approved by Shri Mataji. And here we are in Brahmapuri. But the funny thing is, when it was it is close to Shri Mataji, Shri Mataji actually said, when she was a kid, when she was in the school, she actually came to Satara back in, we are talking here, 19, before 1940s, or around that time when Shrimataji was a student. And she was a team leader, captain for a sport called Kabaddi, women's Kabaddi. 
And that is one of the really intense sport, Indian sport. It's a uh, kabaddi. Now, do watch on YouTube how they get played, and you'll realize how much strength you need to play that. And Shamataji actually came along with her school kids as a captain, and she visited Fort Sajjangad, Ajinkyathara, and few places around here. Shumataji, Shumataji, I am very happy. Shumataji, I am very happy. I am very happy. I am very happy. I am आणि शिमाताजी ना आम्ही एक आमचं नवीन वसाहत तयार होत होते आणि शिमाता एका रूम एका घरात आम्ही शिमाताजी उतरवलं होतं आणि परदेशी पाहुण्यांना कार्यालयात उतरवलं होतं आणि पूजा आमच्या दारात होती तर शिमाताजी म्हटले आजचं पूजन आपण वास्तुपूजन करणार आहोत आणि शिमाताजीने स्वतः म्हणजे ग्रहप्रवेश आणि वास्तुपूजन केलं तर शिमाताजी म्हटले शिमातांना दारात ओवाळलं तर त्या म्हटल्या की आम्हाला घरातून फिरायचं आहे तर शिमातांना म्हटलं शिमाताजी खाली मुरुम आहे आपल्या चरणाला टोचेल तर नाही म्हटल्या वास्तूला आमचे चरण लागले पाहिजेत मग शिमाताजी अनवानी फिरून पूजेच्या ठिकाणी बसल्या मग आमचं पूजन केल्यानंतर कुंकवन अभिषेक केला मग पाण्यानं केला मग शिमाताजी म्हटलं हे सगळं मिक्स करा आणि घराभोवती टाका काही आता तुम्हाला त्रास होणार नाही आणि आजचं पूजन आपलं वास्तुपूजन केलं मग पूजन झाल्यानंतर आम्ही परत रूमवर गेलो शिमाताईने मला एक शालू दिला होता आणि नेसा म्हणून सांगितलं मग काही वर्षांना लक्षात आलं की एखाद्याचं वास्तुशांती असले की आपण काहीतरी गिफ्ट देतो म्हणजे शिमाताईने आम्हाला प्रत्येक गोष्ट असं वागून शिकवलं असं सांगून नाही प्रत्येक गोष्ट खूप म्हणजे बारीक सारीक असं आणि मग आम्ही गेलो रूमवर तर मग फॉरेनर्सकडनं एवढे पैसे गोळा होऊन आले शिमाताजी म्हटलं घ्या म्हटलं कसले शिमाताजी तर आत्ताच्या पूजनाचे तर म्हटलं शिमाताजी आपण म्हटलं ना वास्तुपूजन केलं मग आता ग्रहशांती झाल्यावर हे पण आपले पाहुणेच ना मग त्यांचे पैसे कसे घ्यायचे मग शिमाताजी म्हटल्या अहो पण प्रत्येक ठिकाणी देतो की नाही जेवणाचे पैसे मग म्हटलं माझ्या डोळ्यात जरा पाणी आलं मग राहू द्या म्हणे अकरा ब्लाऊज पीसचे पैसे घ्या म्हटलं ठीक आहे मग ही बुद्धी त्याच देतात Um, so this is 1982. Uh, first time Shumataji came with uh, India to Maharashtra too. And um, there was a house ge was getting built named Krishnai. Um, it was under construction. It wasn't completed at the time in 1982. And Shumataji came to the door and she took her chapels off and she said, I just want to walk. So the one, there wasn't floor done, so it was still concrete and gravel everywhere. And Shimataji wanted to walk through the house with a bare feet. And she had a walk through that entire house. And after that, uh, there was a small puja was done, performed outside the house. So after that puja was finished, Shimataji gave sari to Auntie Kenzile as a gift as well as uh, puja contribution was given to her for the expenses of puja and she said if that was our housewarming puja then we can't take we can't we can't take money from our guest so now we can't take money shrimathi so shrimathi said okay that's fine just take this sari as a gift and she received the sari from shrimathi but she still carry it She's, she's going back to Rahuri, a little bit back. Rahuri Shumata ji, chabarabara ami guest house la sag karya karai so. Ani Rahuri so dashi Shumata ji am cha ghariye pratyek var shale le ahet. Tar ek var she guest house la Shumata ji hotya ani ghari jeva le nar hotya. Sangit lo to to. Shumata ji, ami manje Shumata ji vada bhoto to sagre zan ghari ani Shumata ji in chagda kon guest ale hotya guest house la. आणि शिमाताजी त्यांच्याशी गप्पा मारत होत्या आणि मग कुणीतरी आठवण केली शिमाताजीना की शिमाताजी आपल्याला केंद्र साहेबांच्या घरी जेवायला जायचं आहे हो हो म्हणे चला ते आपली वाट बघत असतील मग शिमाताजी तशाच सोफ्यावरनं उठल्या आणि चालायला लागल्या 
तर ते आपले सहजोगी म्हटले की शिवमाताजी आपण अशाच निघाला आहे चप्पल तरी म्हणजे कार राहू दे पायात चप्पल तरी असू देत नाही नाही म्हणे भक्त आमच्यासाठी एवढं करतात तर आम्ही त्यांच्यासाठी एवढं तर करू शकतो सो ॲट वन दिस वॉज अराउंड नाईन्टीन सेवन्टी सेवन मिसेस कॅन्सल आज इन माय टच मॅथजी फॉर डिनर ॲट हर प्लाईस लंच होता का डिनर सॉरी माय मिस्टेक इट वॉज अ लंच अँड श्री माथाजी वॉज इन द गेस्ट हाऊस मे बी अराउंड फोर फोर फायव्ह हंड्रेड मीटर्स अवाय अँड समबडी रिमांड एट श्री माथाजी इट्स गेटिंग लाईट वी शूड गो टू मिसेस कॅन्सलेस हाऊस बिकॉज द लंच बीन ऑर्गनाइज देअर अँड श्री माथाजी सेड ओ ये लेट्स गो अँड शी स्टार्टेड वॉकिंग विदाउट शूज सो समबडी सेड ओ ॲट लिस्ट वेअर अ चप्पल श्री माथाजी ओर शूज अँड शी सेड नो नो द डिसायफल इज वेटिंग फॉर मे आय हॅव टू गो देअर ॲज क्विक ॲज आय कॅन वी शूड गो and shamata ji came for a lunch actually i'm going to take one more story back similar to him ek mandal sa this story is yeah it comes one after another one after another um, i don't know how much patience you have to keep <laughs> listening us but it If it gets too much just let us know we can have a break. Yeah. It's okay because if someone wants to sleep they can just go to sleep which is here so it doesn't change. तर आमचे म्हणजे भोळी भक्ती होती आमची. श्री माताने आपण कसं गप्पा मारतोय असं श्री मातांच्याशी बोलत होतो आम्ही. तर श्री मातांचा अहमदनगरला प्रोग्राम होता. तर माझी बहीण म्हणजे ह्याची आई म्हणजे माझी बहीण तिथं राहत होते नगरला तर मी तिला म्हटलं की आपण श्री मातेजीना तुझ्या घरी चहासाठी बोलूया आणि मग प्रोग्रामला श्री मातेजी जातील तर मग देसाई काका म्हटले अहो तिथं प्रोग्राम आहे आणि तुम्ही असं मध्येच म्हटलं नाही आम्हाला तर ते म्हटले ठीक आहे मग मी त्यांना सांगितलं की तुम्ही श्री माताजी आला की तुम्ही फक्त जाऊन दार उघडा आणि औक्षणाची तयारी करा तर सकाळी नऊ वाजता आमची चार मुलं त्यांना दूध दिलं होतं छोटी छोटी होती आणि आम्ही अहमदनगरच्या रस्त्यावर एक लिंबाच्या झाडाखाली उभं राहिलो सकाळी आणि आम्हाला काहीच माहीत नाही श्री माताजी कधी येणार काही काहीच माहीत नाही आणि त्या झाडाची सावली फिरेल तसं आम्ही फिरत होतो श्री माताजी कार माहीत नाही काहीच माहीत नाही रस्त्याने एवढ्या गाड्या जात आहेत येत आहेत पण श्री माताजींना आपण न्यायचं एवढंच आणि मग श्री माताजींची कार चार वाजता आली आणि आमच्यासमोर उभा राहिली तर श्री माताजीना म्हटलं श्री माताजी माझी बहीण इथं राहते आणि आपण तिच्या घरी चलावं चहासाठी मग त्या म्हटलं ठीक आहे बसा कारमध्ये आता कारमध्ये बसायचं म्हटलं की डावा उजवं सांगायला पाहिजे ना म्हटलं नाही श्री माताजी मी चालते जवळच आहे कार माझ्या बरोबर येईल तर मी जरा पाळायला लागले ना तर श्री माता म्हटल्या अहो हळूच आला कार हळू येऊ शकते around 1977 in a district called Ahmadnagar next to Ravri and Auntie Kanzala said to my mom that uh, Shumataji is traveling from Pune to Rahuri and we should invite Shumataji to your place for a small tea break and um, so th- both families organize everything this is this is very old age we are talking back then there weren't phones there weren't mobiles so all we had a information shamathi is leaving from pune on so and so day and coming to rauri so i was the youngest one i think i was 3 3 and a half maybe 3 3 and a half youngest one so we got dragged out and we stand next to the road for from 9 o'clock in the morning till whole day and we used the tree shade whole day and we moved along the tree shade until 4 o'clock the car came out so when the car came out jimathu just stopped and the car stopped and anti kenzile asked if you would like to come for a tea and jimathu said yeah let's let's do it so then she started running ahead the car to pilot the car where which way to go and jimathu said please please don't run just walk the car can driven be slower as well 
And my personal memory as well, in that moment, I was the youngest one running through that dust and we all got into the house and it was a really wonderful afternoon. It was a really memorable afternoon for us. खूप दिवस झाले नगरला पाऊस नाही आहे तर श्री माताजी म्हटल्या हो का मग हे सगळे म्हणजे श्री माताजींनी सगळेजण प्रोग्रामसाठी गेले आणि मी केंद्र साहेबांना म्हटलं की श्री माताजी उद्या आपल्या घरी येतील राहुरीला तर आपण साडी घ्यायला जायचं मग आम्ही श्री माताजींच्यासाठी साडी घ्यायला साडी सारडाच्या दुकानात गेलो आणि जे पाऊस सुरू झाला धो 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 पाऊस तीन तास पाऊस पडत होता आणि सगळं भरून गेलं नद्या म्हणजे आणि पाऊस थांबे ना इकडे श्री मातांचा प्रोग्राम झाला प्रश्न उत्तर झाले तरी आम्ही दुकानातच आणि मग सगळं झाल्यानंतर आम्ही पोहोचलो मग श्री माताजी म्हटल्या हा झाला का मनासारखा पाऊस ऑन द सेम इव्हनिंग देअर वॉज अ पब्लिक प्रोग्राम इन दॅट टाऊन अहमदनगर टाऊन अँड आय मस्ट साय दिस वॉज द फर्स्ट पब्लिक प्रोग्राम इन इंडिया वॉज वेल पोस्टल्ड well advertised and also it had a small invitation card printed at the time to hang out that was the first well organized program by mr kensley and my dad and shrimataji was very happy so auntie kensley and uncle kensley went to buy sari for shrimataji for next puja in ravri and shrimataji entered in this auditorium and while she was entering she said to dad ah oh, I'm really pleased ask me what you want and she said I remember that conversation dad said oh she said we have everything we have everything thank you she said no no when god is when divine is asking you you should ask when divine is offering you you should ask and he said shamata ji we have water issue we don't have much potable water here water will be something good for us for this town Shumati smiled, Uncle Aunty went to the shop. Shumati's first word was, I bowed to the seekers and thunderstorm started. A massive thunderstorm started out there. Pulled for next two hours. There was a whole realization process, lecture of Shumati, question and answer session. Nobody could leave the place. And the whole town was flooded that day. and since then it never been problem there well and this this is something really important for all of us that when we meditate when we ask something to shamata ji ask something which is for the humanity which is for the benevolence of the whole world or for others even goddess has to fulfill that desire because it's not for us it's for the others it's for the universe तर एटी फोरला साताऱ्यातलं आपलं घर तयार झालं होतं श्रीमाताजी राहिल्या होत्या तिथं आणि एक पूजा श्रीमाताजी तिथं झाली आणि आम्ही परदेशी पाहुण्यांना हॉटेलमध्ये उतरवलं होतं की सगळ्यांना त्यांना अटॅच असं आणि श्रीमाताजींची पूजा झाली आणि सगळ्या फॉरेनर्सने फोटो काढले होते पण दुयोलो आले आणि केंद्र साहेबांना म्हणे की श्री माताजीनी मला फोटो घ्यायला सांगितला आहे तर काय करायचं मग श्री माताजी आत रूममध्ये आल्या होत्या दागिने उतरवत होत्या मग ह्याने विचारलं की ते इटालियन सहजोगी आहेत आणि ते असे विचारत आहेत तर श्री माता म्हटलं हो 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 मी त्यांना सांगितलं आहे फोटो घ्यायला मग श्री माताजीनी परत दागिने घातले सगळे केस वगैरे केले आणि खुर्चीत येऊन बसल्या आणि मग त्यांनी तो फोटो काढला धन्वंतरीचा फोटो काढला आणि 
जेव्हा श्रीमाताजी इटलीला गेल्या तेव्हा श्रीमातेनं त्यांनी दिला की हा साताऱ्यात काढलेला फोटो आहे म्हणून आणि जेव्हा सी बी डी बेलापूरचं हेल्थ सेंटर सुरू झालं तेव्हा यू सी ए राय तेव्हा होते तर तेव्हा श्रीमातेने त्यांनी विचारले की आम्ही इथं कुठला फोटो वापरायचा तर मग शेत माताजीने तो काढून दिला की तो फोटो असा आहे की एका डोळ्यात प्रेम आहे एकात वात्सल्य आहे करुणा आहे असा तो वेगळा फोटो आहे आणि तो क्युरिंगसाठी वापरायचा असं श्रीमाताने सांगितलं Um, 1984, when the house was completed in Satara, there was another puja took place in the courtyard. And Shumataji also stayed in that house that year. So all the yogis uh, came, the puja was done, offering was done to Shumataji. After that, Shumataji went in the bedroom and she was just getting changed. And then Italian yogi, one of the photographer, I'm not sure his name, but yeah, he was told that he can take Shumataji's picture. So he came and saw Uncle Kenzile that Shumataji had suggested that the photograph should be taken after the puja. So he went back to Shumataji, uh, Mr. Kenzile went back to Shumataji and said, there is an Italian photographer outside who wants to do the photo, as you asked. And Shumataji said, oh yes. So she put the ornaments again, the um, golden necklace. She came outside, sat on the chair, and the photo was taken. This photo was taken, which currently now getting used around the world as a photograph of Danvantari in a red sari with a ro uh, round necklace. This was done by Italian photographer, and when the research sent Un Uncle Dwilio, yeah? Yep, okay, you know who is he. I never met him. So, uh, when the uh, Washi Hospital were got open, uh, Dr. Yusirai asked Shumataji, which photographs we should use for this program? And Shumataji said, she gave him that photograph. And so he said, this photograph, it has two gestures, two, uh, two powers in them. In one of her eye is the love, compassion, and the other one is uh, destroying negativity. And that's why it's now getting around the world. So Shmataji said it's a photograph of Danvantari. It's good for left and right, both sides. That took place in Satara. Brahmapuri is... Okay. In the program, I was in the program. 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 And I was in the program. 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 तर सांगितलं शिमाताजीना मग शिमाताजी म्हटलं हो का बरं हा मल्हारपेठचा कार्यक्रम झाला की आपण कोयणानगरला जायचं आता कोयणानगरला मोठं डॅम आहे तर फॉरेनर्सना न्यायचं म्हणजे परवानगी पाहिजे तर मग एक सहयोगी प्रोग्रामला थांबले नाहीत ते गेले आणि गेस्ट हाऊसच्या सगळ्या रूम्स चार तासासाठी त्यांनी बुक केल्या आणि मग प्रोग्राम सगळं सांगितलं मग सगळं प्रोग्राम झाल्यानंतर आम्ही गेलो आणि शिवमाताजी एका रूममध्ये झोपल्या होत्या आणि शिवमातांच्या चरणसेवेत मी होते आणि बाकीच्या सगळ्यांना रूम्स मिळाल्या होत्या मग शिवमातांची झोप झाल्यानंतर मला विचारलं तुम्ही झोपला होता की नाही तर म्हटलं नाही शिवमाताजी मग शिवमाताई म्हटलं आम्ही खूप छान झोप काढली आम्हाला खूप छान वाटलं म्हटलं शिवमाताजी आपलं अखंड चालू असतं त्यांना तो शब्द एवढा आवडला की त्यांनी सगळ्यांना बोलवलं आणि सांगितलं बघा ह्या काय म्हणतात की आपलं अखंड चालू असतं आणि हे खरं आहे आम्ही जर झोपलो तर विश्व झोपेल आमचं काम पूर्वी होतं आता आहे आणि पुढेही राहणार आहे
the Lord take us forward like that? And, uh, one year, there was a public program was arranged um, roughly 50 kilometers northwest from here, a place called Malarpet. Now, I, I, I add a little bit story to this town because you guys yesterday, Anandita and you team perform He Adima, He Antima Bhajan. And that was that was first w performed there. And the last wording of that song was um, Sahaj Yoga um, Janakottama Sanak. Yeah, that was added by my um, uncle later on, and that was very much famous later on. And so after the program, public program, Shimataji, Auntie said, further up 30 kilometers is my uh, childhood town called Koinanaga. It's actually a hydro, hydro project, one of the biggest hydro projects of India, uh, power supply. It was constructed in 1940, 1950s, and it's still there, it's working. And Shimatha said, okay, let's go and stay there today. So the whole tour went and stayed there uh, for four or five hours. And while uh, everybody was just having walk around and everything, Shmataji was in bedroom resting. And after a couple of hours when she opened her eyes, she said to Auntie Kenzile, oh, just one second. Uh, she said to Auntie Kenzile, oh, did, you, did you also sleep? Because I really had a wonderful sleep here. And Auntie Kenzile said, And Shima, Auntie Kenzile said to Shimataji, no Shimataji, you, you never sleep. You are always working. You are always there for everyone. And Shimataji laughed loud and she invited, called everybody in the room and she said, listen what this one's saying. And it is true. If I sleep, the whole world will fall asleep. I have to. I have to, I have to be awake for all of you. I've always been awake. I'm awake now and I will, I will always be awake for all humankind. So here is our goddess working hard, tremendously, timelessly, effortlessly. And all she wants from us is one thing, is love, is bhakti. That's all she wants from us. She is doing everything. Program Zaranta Rami Nighalu, Ratrish Verhuti, Pornimish Ratrothi, Ani Chandra La Grand Lagloto. Terha Foronesha Pasai Steve Sesota, Shimatan Chica, Tema, Pon Vogarasakai Noto. तर चंद्राला ग्रहण लागलं होतं तर मग शिवमातेने विचारलं की शिवमाताजी योगाने ग्रहण बघणं चांगलं की नाही तर शिवमाताजी म्हटल्या सहज योगाना काही नाही पण कशाला बघायचं चंद्र म्हणजे आमचे भाऊ तुमचे मामा त्यांना त्रास होताना नाही बघितलेलं चांगलं आणि शिवमातेने बंधन दिलं आणि म्हटल्या सुटला आता मग चंद्रावरून प्रभू रामचंद्रावर विषय निघाला मग ह्यांनी सांगितलं की शिवमाताजी रामदास स्वामी जे हनुमानाचं अवतरण त्यांनी इथं चाफळा रामाचं मंदिर बांधलंय तर शिवमाताई म्हटलं हो का चला म्हणे आपण राम मंदिरात जायचं आता रात्रीचे वेळ आता हे सगळे घेऊन जायचं म्हणजे तर पण मला काय मी शिवमाताईंच्या बरोबरच होते पण हे बाकी ऑर्गनाईज करणार आहे पण आम्ही सगळे चाफळा गेलो आणि परतीचा प्रवास सुरू झाला चंद्राला घेऊन लागला Okay, I, I'm also, yeah, I'm also getting carried away <laughs> listening the stories. Uh, yeah, um, yeah. So on the way back, return back from Koinanaga, it um, the night was started, and happened to be uh, um, eclipse night on the moon. So someone asked Shimataji, "Is it okay for yogis to watch uh, eclipse on the moon?" And she said. There's nothing wrong, but why you want to see your brother Moon is suffering? It's a suffering. 
why you want to see your brother suffering and she put bandhan and that for <laughs> ah sorry my correction it's not our brother moon is a brother of shamataji so it's our uncle why do we want to see our uncle suffering and she put bandhan and that one was finished and then topic turn into shri rama now this is interesting marathi language the moon the word moon get used in marathi language with lot of sweetness now this is where marathi literature marathi poetry anandita will um, uh, relate to this this is this is where the beauty of marathi culture is the marathi literature the abhangas the songs which has been created by all the saints and older uh, uh, literature has tremendous love the expression style to it that it brings human beings attention straight to the bhakti for maharashtrian it is not difficult to establish the bhakti it doesn't need a different explanation to create how bhakti is it's just that marathi has that beauty so chandra means the moon can be used in such a way in the literature in the language that it adds the beauty it adds a lot to it so in marathi they call shri rama sometime as a rama chandra when you add the chandra in front of rama it becomes more joyful it becomes more loveful it connection goes to the bhakti to it shri rama chandra so the topic started the next topic from moon it started into shri rama shri rama chandra and then uncle nalgil uh, sorry uncle kenzale said to shri mataji that uh, shri ramadasa sage ramadasa which was an incarnation of shri hanumana had worked in this area had traveled for a bit in this area and she he he mentioned to shimataji there is a temple nearby here where he took those uh, statues of shri rama sita and lakshmana in that political place and shimataji said oh is it is it close by and he said yep she said let's go so <laughs> late I night yeah the ne- it wasn't planned tour it was just like mention and shimataji said all right let's go middle of night you don't know whether the temple is going to be open or anything and shimataji is just like we're going to do it let's do it and that's how they ended up all the tour ended up there and temu ami mandirat gelo shimataji basle hote sagle shimatanchya samor basle sagana chaha milala kuni kela mahit nahi par sagana chaha milala mo shimataji mata sanga ya mandirachi gosht tar mo shimatayla sangitle ki ramdas swami je hanumanacha avtaran तो त्यांनी एक दगडाचं छोटंसं मंदिर त्यांच्या ध्यानधारणेसाठी तिथं बांधलं होतं आणि त्यांना असं वाटलं की आता मी रामाची मूर्ती कुठून आणू तर त्यांना प्रश्न पडला की आता रामाची मूर्ती कुठून आणायची मग त्यांना दृष्टांत झाला की आम्ही इथं अंगापूरच्या हा कृष्णेचा डोह आहे त्या डोहात आम्ही आहोत आणि घेऊन या तर रामदास स्वामी आले त्यांनी डोहात बुटकी डुबकी मारली आणि राम सीता लक्ष्मण आणि आंगलाई देवी अशा मूर्ती बाहेर काढल्या आणि मग त्यांनी पलीकडं अंगापूरच्या क्षेत्रात त्या ठेवल्या थोडा वेळ तर मग अंगापूरच्या लोकांना वाटलं की आमच्या मूर्ती आहेत म्हणजे त्यांना समजलं ना की रामदास स्वामींना मूर्ती सापडल्यात मग ते सगळे आले गावकरी आणि म्हटले की आमच्या मूर्ती आहेत आमच्या नदीत सापडल्या तर आम्हाला पाहिजेत तर रामदास स्वामी म्हटले ठीक आहे तुम्ही घ्या तुम्ही मंदिर बांधा आणि ते निघून गेले मग या अंगापूरच्या लोकांनी बैलगाडी सजवून लेझरी वगैरे सगळं वाजंत्री घेऊन आले त्या मूर्ती न्यायला तर त्या एवढ्या एवढ्या दगडाशा मूर्ती आहेत तर त्या सगळ्यांनी प्रयत्न केला पण त्या मूर्ती हालेच नात मग सगळ्यांच्या लक्षात आलं की आपलं हे चुकलं मग रामदास स्वामींना शोधून आणलं आणि सांगितलं की आमचं चुकलं आम्हाला क्षमा करा आणि ह्या आपल्या मूर्ती आहेत त्या आपण घेऊन जावा मग रामदास स्वामी आले एका हातानं उचलल्या झोळीत टाकल्या आणि घेऊन गेले आणि मग रामसीताची स्थापना त्यांनी चाफडं केली आणि आंगलाई देवीची सज्जनगडावर केली मग श्री मातेने विचारलं की आंगलाई म्हणजे काय तर हे म्हटले की जसं सीता राधा तसं आंगलाई नाही म्हटलं आंगलाई म्हणजे आंग्ल लोकांची आई म्हणजे परदेशी लोकांची आई म्हणजे मेरी माता मेरी माता इथं आहेत म्हणून हे फॉरेनर्स तुमच्याकडे येतात असेच ते येत नाही आहेत 
So, um, Sri Mataji took the tour, all the foreigners, into this little town, Chaffa, where this uh, temple is. And um, then Sri Mataji said, tell us more about this. And some our house, some villagers offered tea to all that tour. And um, then the story came up that when Sri Ramadasa was in that area, he actually went, he carved himself a small cave. Now this is interesting. I've been to that cave and next tour when you come in, let's lock it in that one. You can only go one person at a time in this cave. To go in that cave, it's interesting. You stand straight, you lower your body inside because that's all it's carved. So I can fit in, I'm 85, I go in, you stand. When you touch your feet, you slowly kneel down and then start crawling and then you go into a small chamber. Now in that chamber, you have to lie on your back and slide yourself to more smaller hole into another chamber. And that's when you say, you actually touch your head to the wall, roof, your hand, legs, when you sit in a lotus position, your hand, everything is sort of wrapped up with a stone around you. It's a really nice care. Let's lock it in next year. We'll, yeah, we'll do that one next. So, <laughs> so um, coming back to the point, so when he used to meditate there, Shima, one day he thought, okay, I'm meditating, but I'm missing something. I need something. And he realized he needed a statue. He needed an idol of Sri Rama, whom he used to worship. And he had a realization, he had a dream that he had an indication, go to Brahmapuri. It's waiting for you here. So he came all that 50 kilometers here. He had a bath in the river. He had a, he had a dip and he discovered those two idols, which one of them, you, some of you have seen it today on Sajangan Ford. It's a goddess and lie. And the other one, which we are talking, Sri Rama, is in the other place, which will lock it in next year's tour. So let's keep that one in. But uh, interestingly, Goddess Anglai, Srimathi said, ask question to uh, yogis, what is Goddess Anglai? And nobody could say, and she said, Anglai means Anglo, it's a uh, goddess of uh, Anglicans or uh, Westerners. Angla. Angla is a, Mara, a sort of a Sanskrit Marathi word which stands for Westerners. So it's a goddess of Westerners. So we can say like something, goddess Athena, or it's a more close to Mother Mary, according to Shri when she said that. And that's what you must have felt when you went there today, that vibrations were coming from that direction. Yeah. <laughs> एकोणीसशे सदुसष्टला भूकंप झाला होता आणि त्याच्यात त्या मंदिराला थोड्याशा चिरा पडल्या होत्या मग मुंबईचे मफतलाल म्हणून एक इंडस्ट्रीज आहेत ते रामभक्त तर त्यांनी ते मंदिर बांधलं संगमरवरी मंदिर आणि पौर्णिमेची रात्र होती ते मंदिर झळकत होतं मग शिवमाताजी म्हटलं इतकं सुंदर मंदिर कुणी बांधलं मग सांगितलं शिवमातांना ते रामभक्त आहेत त्यांनी बांधलं मग शिवमाताजी म्हटलं एक डोनर एवढं बांधू शकतो केंद्र साहेबांना म्हटलं की एक डोनर एवढं बांधू शकतो तो तुम्ही का नाही बांधत नाही तुम्ही पण बांधाल आणि तुम्हाला पण डोनर मिळतील असं म्हणजे ह्यांना माहीत नाही की आता मी भक्त म्हणजे शिवमाताजींचा मी मंदिर बांधणार कुणाचं बांधणार कुठं बांधणार काही माहीत नाही म्हणजे ब्रह्मपुरीचं तेव्हा काही नाव नव्हतं मग शिवमाताजींचं पुढचं कसं सगळं ठरलेलं असतं असं सो इट वॉज अ फुल मोन नाट वेन शिवमाताजी वॉज ॲट दिस राम रामदास टेम्पल This temple, uh, in 1962, with the earthquake, it was broken, but then there was a gentleman from Mumbai, a businessman actually, uh, put a lot of money together and created a new temple on top of that with a complete marble structure. And with a full moon night, it was very sparkly. And Srimadhaji was very happy and she said, this is, this is beautiful and you should have my temple. If one person can make something like that, Imagine all of you, what you can create of me. You should have my temple. 
you should have one uh, one of my temple and here we are where we are sitting today in brahmapuri was the foundation of this the idea the seedling of this was done in place called safo that was the hain shimat ji gave us mm -hmm. that one person can create something imagine all we together what can we create around the world and brahmapur that's how brahmapur is started and slowly slowly local communities started coming together spending time together putting the management together and few things worked out nicely and today we are here enjoying this place there's more to go and um, i'll just tell you more about that corner there i did touch that yesterday those products there are uh, 2000 I'll, I will continue and then I'll tell you later. Uh, Shri Matan Shri Tur, I mean, there are four days of program. Shri Matan Shri Mirunu, I mean, I am going to go to Khedegawa. I mean, Khedegawa, the ladies are very devoted. So, Shri Matan Shri Bailgadi, I mean, Mirunu, I mean, 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 मुझे माता है मैंने आओ मैं घेत नहीं नहीं थोड़ा तरीका है मुझे ते खेड़े तले रोक कर चाबाए कर चाहते भावना मुझे माता एक समसा समसा गया चा अच्छा ते मेरोनो को गिरे भाई ची अस खूब मुझे एन्जॉय किया सगे ने सो दिस इज वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग टाइम चार दिन सच प्रोग्राम में दे सभी के लोग प्रोग्राम खेड़ेगा the tour used to come here for around four days and all those four days evening there used to be a program in various cities and small villages back then Shimataji used to travel in bullock car just to give you idea this road here which you went to the river Shimataji had walked on this road without shoes and she walked through here and went in that next building yeah. next school yeah yeah. So every evening we had a program and Shramataji used to travel in bullock car and traditionally people welcome you when you pass through their doors and Shramataji, they were offering cup of tea and she, was, she wasn't drinking all but she was taking spoon after spoon just keeping everybody happy because she didn't want to, you know, she wanted to just give a joy to everyone. The Faccio un altro piccolo capitolo. Rira era ottima satarla, ani foreigna si vede osta a me hotel ma de kelle uti. A mala vatle che a me kiti chan sab kelle. Ma tu rasai si, pratek varshi, ma program Mumbai la sai si, meeting manje. Tra a me kelle uto Mumbai la program tharvala. Tamo ka jama satara var number ala te var shumata che matlia. Ki या वाला का ही मंडरी तो तुम्हें तैना खराब खुरा जंगला ठेवला तो ते ना रहे नहीं तो तैना तुम्हें होटल में दे उतरोला तैना का आटा शोगर का लागत नहीं ते खूब श्रीमंत लोग का है ते चारों खूब सगाई पैसा है गाड़ियाँ है ते जैसे ठीते ये इतना है ही योग भूमि आए हितलोपाहिप्रेशन मशीन माता जी समझ लिया हाँ तीता मोटे मोटे झाड़ा है फौश माता जी हाँ तीता नदी है हाँ शिव माता जी मकाय नाव मटला तब ब्रह्मपुरी मग आमसर्स्टी कान ये तीन मणे हैं सगे मंडरी मग माझा मना थोड़ा अलग की ब्रह्मपुरी मंजे रिमोट प्लेस आहे मशीन माता जी कश है ना ना आता तेरी छाना है पंते वाला एटी फोर लो आई कशा ये शिव माता जीन अस मना आल मशी माता जी मैं हाथ के मटल आम् हा जन्मत हे आम शबरी है हे आमच सग कर आम्मी सुधा यू मी डोक्यापस पयापर्यन थंड मे अपनी कल्पना पवड़ी नहीं ना अस <laughs> Before we started having tours in Brahmapuri, all the foreigners used to, the tour used to be accommodated in the hotels in a town. And this was a pre-tour uh, pre meeting, couple of months before the December tour. And um, 
when the turn come for Satara, Shimati said, so where are we gonna accommodate people this time? And the ideal position was uh, Rajatadri Hotel in Satara, and Shimati said, no, no, Westerners always stays in hotel and all. They need to experience more. They need to experience a little bit more India. We need something better place. We need something connected to the nature. So then uh, Shumatha said, is there something around Satara that with the big trees? And this guy said, yeah, 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 there is a place. Uh, is there a river? Yes, there is a river. She said, what's the name? And this guy said, oh, it's uh, Brahmapuri. And she said, ah, oh, that's my place. Let's do it. And so that's how Brahmapuri started. The two started coming. And immediate first reaction came in Auntie Mrs. Kinsley's um, mind is, well, we are talking here 30 years ago. Back then, there weren't roads, there weren't proper accommodations or anything. It was pretty jungle. And um, when she realized, oh, Shumatri wants to go here, she thought, how are we going to look after Shumatri here? It's, there's nothing. How are we going to do it? And Shumataji read that mind straight away. And she said immediately, Ah, oh, don't, don't worry. You are my uh, Shabri. Now, I don't know if you know the story about Shabri. Shabri is the correct, um, one of the characters from um, Ramayana, uh, especially when Sri Rama was uh, gone into exile from um, with Rama, Sita, uh, with Sita and Lakshmana. He was going through Dandaka. Hmm. He was going through Dandaka Aranya, and um, Shabri was one of the. This is this is where Bhakti comes in. Yeah, there. Yeah. I hope I will put it nicely. So Shabri was very much in love with the Bhakti to Sri Rama from her childhood, and now she's an old lady. And she was waiting for Sri Rama to come to her one day and then she can serve him. So every morning she used to go and collect berries, fruit berries, and she used to taste them individually, every single berry, and select the sweetest one in a different bowl. And if it is not sweet, she will throw away that. And her desire came true. One day, Sri Rama appeared to Dandakara and Nia with Sita and Lakshmana. And she was over the moon that the moment she waited for, it was there. And she offered the berries, half eaten berries, to Sri Rama. And um, Sri Rama immediately appreciated it. He, could, he felt the love of that disciple, that bhakti, in the love in that he started eating, where Lakshmana wasn't happy with it because it was a half-eaten stuff. You can't offer half-eaten to the god or goddesses. And he wasn't happy. And goddess, uh, Sita started enjoying as well. And later on, Lakshmana also tried it. And he realized how sweet they were. And the only reason they were sweet because it was chosen very carefully, very carefully, every single berry. We are talking berry, that tiny. They're not big. But it was done with an absolute affection, love, bhakti. That bhakti chapter is always there. And this is when that thought came about Brahmapuri in Mrs. Kane's life. Shimathi said, oh, don't worry. I'll, you are my shabri. I know I'll be looked after well. मशी माता जी एटी फोर ला इथा लिया आपन अतः ते पहला सर्श माता जी वास्तु ते एरिकेशन से शेडा है तिथो त्या केटी वर्ष सामान ठोड़ने सर्टी आ सकते तो सरकारी है आमी में चार दिवस सर्टी ते गेट होतो अनशी माता जी पूजे नंतर थोड़ा वे थामतीर ऐसा माला वाटा है तो वाटलो तो आणि आम्ही ते सगळं छान सजवलेलं होतं अशी माता आहे थोडा वेळ विश्रांती घेतील आणि साताऱ्यात राहतील असं आम्हाला वाटत होतं आणि त्या रूमच्या समोरचं शेतात मांडव घातलेला होता फॉरेनर्ससाठी आणि शिव माताजींचा साताऱ्यात प्रोग्राम झाला शिव माताजीचं जेवण झालं घरी आणि विचार अशी माताजींनी कुठं आहेत हे 
फॉरेनर्स तर सांगितलं शिमाताई ते ब्रह्मपुरीत आहेत मग रात्रीचा वेळ होती शिमाताजी म्हटल्या चला आपण ब्रह्मपुरीला जायचं मग शिमाताजी म्हटलं शिमाताजी तिथं काय काहीच व्यवस्था नाही आहे तिथं लाईट नाही कसलीच व्यवस्था नाही तर शिमाताजी म्हटलं हे फॉरेनर्स आहेत ना त्यांच्याकडे मोठे मोठे लाईटनिंग असतात त्यांना आपण चालवू चला म्हण मग आम्ही रात्री निघालो आणि आता तरी रस्ते चांगले आहेत तेव्हा रस्ता काही चांगला नव्हता एके ठिकाणी आल्यानंतर दोन फाटे फुटले त्या रस्त्याला मग ह्यांच्या लक्षात ये ना की ह्या रस्त्यानं जायचं का ह्या रस्त्यानं जायचं आता रात्र झाली होती तिथं सांगायलाही कोणी नव्हतं मग शिव हे म्हणे मी उतरतो तर शिमाताई म्हटलं नको नको ते दाखवत आहेत तर एक व्यक्ती की त्याच्या डोक्यावर पागोटं होतं घोंगडं होतं हातात लाठी होती आणि ते दाखवत होते असं जायचं मग शिमाताईंनी सांगितलं की आपल्याला असं जायचं आहे मग शिमाताईंच्यावर गण असतात हे पाहिलं आम्ही बऱ्याच वेळा ह्याचा एक मध्येच सांगते ह्याचा एक अनुभव सांगते तर राहुरीत असताना गेस्ट हाऊसला असताना सहजोग वाढत होता मग आपली कशी भोळी भक्ती ना मग शिमाताजींना म्हटलं शिमाताजी मला असं वाटतं की हे मंत्री लोकांना कसं प्रोटेक्शन असतं ना तसं आपण आता एकट्याच फिरता कुठं कुठं तर मला असं वाटतं की धट्टे कट्टे सहजोगी आपल्याबरोबर असावेत मग शिमाताई सगळं ऐकत होत्या मग पुन्हा हसल्या म्हटल्या अहो आम्हाला काय होणार आहे कोणी बंदूक घेऊन आला तर त्याचा हात मुळासहित गळून पडेल आणि तुम्हाला पण काय होणार नाही सहजोग सहजोग्यांना तुमच्या भोवती पण माझं बंधन आहे तुम्हासुद्धा कोणीसुद्धा टच करणार नाही त्याच्यानंतर अजून त्याच्याबद्दलची गोष्ट आहे पण हे एवढं बस करते सो नाव दिस इज अबाउट ब्रह्मपुरी यु मस्ट हॅव सेम दर इज अ बिल्डिंग दर इज अ व्हाईट कलर टेम्पल ऑन अ राईट हँड साईड अँड बिहाइंड द व्हाईट कलर टेम्पल दर इज अ क्रीम अँड अ ब्राऊन मेटल रूप बिल्डिंग it's just there yeah, have a look tomorrow again that's where shimata ji stayed so that is actually a government property which used to store the uh, metal panels for that water dam catchment area in that area so we used to hire for four days and shimata ji actually stayed in that building we had few pujas there as well it's really nice there have a look and now it is we are in a deal with the local government so we actually created another similar structure 200 meters away from the original structure and very soon it will be transferred so we will be getting that original place where shimata ji stayed we will be re- renovating that place and redesign the same way the way shimata ji was staying at the time so next time when you come in it will be there available so <laughs> on one evening shimathi was coming back from sathara after the public program and um, as you're coming from this side uh, it's very dark there's no light and uncle kenzile was with shimathi in the car and at one stage he lost the way he couldn't figure it out which way to go because there were a couple of roads joining each other and he got stressed like shimathi is in the car and we don't know which way to go to brahmapuri and all of a sudden the person appeared there with a stick in a hand and a blanket on his sho- shoulder and a turban a small turban now this particular costume back then it's actually in maharashtrian culture that's how shri vitala also appeared in some of the areas so it was a gana waiting for shimata ji and he pointed them which way to go in the middle of night nobody in the bush and this figure appeared and told them go that way and shimata said okay let's go that way and that's how ganas wherever shimata ji is ganas are always there they are protecting her they are watching her but at the same time they are protecting us as well but they are protecting us as a brothers and sisters but to shimata ji they are her children as we are तर ए टू टूला पूजा झाल्यानंतर शिवमाताजी म्हटलं की आपल्याला नदीवर जायचं मग हा फोटो आहे तो तर आपल्या परदेशी सगळ्या फॉरेनर्स लेडीजनी त्यांचे भारी भारी शालू शिवमातांच्या रूमपासून नदीपर्यंत प्रत्येकीनं आपला आपला शालू टाकला होता की तो व्हायब्रेट झाला पाहिजे 
आणि शिवमाताजी मग त्याच्यावरून चालत मग नदीवर गेल्या आणि मग सगळ्यांनी शिवमाताजींच्या चरणांचे पूजन केलं म्हणजे हातात पाणी घेऊन असं मग शिवमाताजी म्हटलं ह्या बाजूला जे लोक आहेत त्यांनी ह्या बाजूला या म्हणजे आमच्या चरणावरून जे पाणी व्हायब्रेट होतं आहे ते तुम्हाला सगळ्यांना मिळेल आणि तेव्हा पूर्वेच्या खडकावर गणेशांचं चित्र आलं होतं आणि इंद्रधनुष्य आलं होतं आणि शेवटी एकोणीसशे नव्वदला तो त्या शिवमाता त्या वेळेला गेलेल्या आहेत त्या नदीत तेव्हा शिवमाताजी बाहेर आल्या आणि खडकावर उभ्या राहून आकाशात बघून नमस्कार करत होत्या तर मग शिवमाताजी म्हटल्या की सगळे देवदेवता आकाशात आलेत आणि त्यांना हेवा वाटतो आहे की ह्या मानवांना प्रोटोकॉल माहीत नाही काय नाही आम्हाला देवांनासुद्धा दुर्लभ आदिशक्तीचं पूजन करणं शिवमाता म्हणजे आदिशक्ती ह्या मानवांच्याकडून पूजन करून घेत आहेत तर शिवमाताजी म्हटल्या म्हणजे आता पूर्वी एका दुसरं फळ लागत होतं झाडाला आता वृक्ष बहरला आहे त्यामुळे ह्या सगळ्यांच्यासाठी आम्ही आलेलो आहोत असं So uh, twice b- between 1982 to 1990 twice Shumata ji went to the river where you were yesterday having bath and sputso um and one of the particular occasion Shumata ji asked everybody to be downstream where she was sitting and the reason was so the Krishna was flowing water through her feet into everybody so imagine the time yogis had here and all that road up from that cabin all the way to the river was getting covered by all the shawls and saris by everybody and shumata ji was walking barefoot all the way to the river coming back it was very joyful to see everybody standing and spreading our saris used saris of expensive saris expensive shawls and i'm sure a lot of people out there has a vibrated items with them still and so joyful one one time shamata ji actually stood after the shower she stood on one of the rock looked at the sky and there is a paint uh, there is a photograph that shamata ji by herself in the river looking at the sky and she said that all the gods and goddesses are here and they are very jealous right now and they are saying to her that what is this this human being don't know proper protocol how to worship adi shakti and you are getting them you are giving them a chance and we are here missing out all the action thod kya data बास करूया कारण अनुभव खूप आहे पण तर इथं हे शिवमाताजींच्या इच्छेनं त्यांची इच्छा होती की इथं मंदिर व्हावं त्यांच्या इच्छे खात्र आपण हे इथं मंदिर बांधलेलं आहे आणि शिवमाताजी म्हटलं की हे तुम्ही वेगळं बांधायचं वेगळं ट्रस्ट तुमचं राहील तेव्हा जर अवघड वाटत होतं कारण राहुडीला जे आरडगावला आहे तर त्या त्याचं स्थापना शिवमाताजींनी केली होती आणि मला त्याचं अध्यक्ष बनवलं होतं आमचा अकरा ज जणींचा ट्रस्ट होता आणि तिथं आम्ही पुष्कळ काम केलं तिथंसुद्धा शिवमाताजींचं असं होतं की लेडीजना न काहीतरी काम असलं पाहिजे किंवा त्यांचा उद्धार झाला पाहिजे म्हणून शिवमाताजींनी सहा शिवणाच्या मशीन दिल्या होत्या आणि शिंगव्याला जाऊन आम्हाला सांगितलं होतं की तुम्ही हे लेडीज लोकांना शिकवायचं म्हणजे शिवमाताजींचं लेडीजवर फार त्यांना इंडिपेंड करायचं असं हे होतं So this is another unique quality uh Shumata ji always insisted that women should be independent self motivated self uh, employed as well and Shumata ji always supported the local businesses the traditional art the art, pottery stitching so Aradga was the first trust was developed ashram was established by Shumata ji and she actually given six sewing machines for the ladies to work together stitch together and um yeah that was started near ambadnagar and then we started something here in brahmapuri now तर शिवमाता जी ने संगित कि वेगा ट्रस्ट कराए 
पाच नावं आणून द्या आणि मग आम्ही ते दिलं मग शिव माताजी म्हटलं फक्त हे कागदोपत्री लागतं ना लिगल करण्यासाठी म्हणून फक्त ही पाच नावं आहेत आणि काम तर सगळ्यांनी करायचं आहे विश्वातल्या प्रत्येकाचा इथं काही ना काहीतरी हातभार लागला पाहिजे हे फक्त नॉमिनल आहेत आणि शिव माताजी प्रत्येक वेळेला आम्ही जाऊन सांगायचो मग शिव माताजी प्रत्येक वेळेला म्हणणार अनंत आशीर्वाद आहेत आणि ते होणार आहे आणि आमची इच्छा आहे आता आम्हाला शिव माताजी दोन हजारला सांगितलं की आमचं काहीतरी झालं पाहिजे मग तर असं अचानक कुठं जमीन मिळणार मग ही टेकडी होती मग शिव माताईनं सांगितलं की प्रतिष्ठानला गेलो होतो सांगितलं शिव माताजी असं आम्हाला जागा मिळालेली आहे तर शिव माताजी म्हटलं की माझ्या अनंत आशीर्वाद आहेत आणि ते होणार आहे हनुमानाला सांगितलं तर एका रात्री तिकडचा डोंगर तिकडं ठेवतील पण तुम्हा विश्वातल्या सगळ्या सहजोग्यांना काहीतरी काम पाहिजे म्हणून हे काम दिलेलं आहे नाव द वर्ल्ड यू हर्ड कपल ऑफ थॉम्स इज अनंत अनंत मीन्स इन्फिनेट शिमाथाची यूज वेन वेन एव शी गेव दस ब्लेसिंग she said in marathi or hindi she always said ananta ashirwad means infinite blessing there is no limit to it she never hold her hand or anything for herself she always gave us she always gave us with a word like anant or she used the word ananya bhakti a means infinite even our bhakti she expect from us is ananya unconditional love unconditional infinite love infinite attention infinite blessing if we put our bhakti infinite ananya bhakti we are selfish as a human being we only going to get ananta shivad infinite blessing wherever shamata ji when she started project various project all she wanted from us united together be together and everything will work out she will put everything for us all we had to do is infinite surrender and this is how brahmapuri its foundation was laid and is continue and it will continue ahead Thank you. Thank you. Jai Shri Mataji. Jai Shri Mataji.